Schema theory, a foundational concept in cognitive psychology, explains how knowledge is organized and retrieved. Proposed by British psychologist Frederick Bartlett in 1932, schema theory suggests that our brains use structured mental frameworks, or schemas, to process new information efficiently. Schemas act as cognitive shortcuts, helping us categorize and interpret vast amounts of data, making sense of complex environments and situations. Schemas develop from personal experiences, social interactions, and cultural background. They function by filtering incoming information based on what we already know, shaping perception and memory. For example, when encountering a new situation, such as dining at a restaurant, people rely on a schema for how this experience typically unfolds, entering, ordering, eating, and paying. This pre-existing knowledge allows quick adaptation without consciously processing every detail. Schemas are dynamic and evolve with experience. They are categorized into various types, such as event schemas, scripts for typical occurrences, like attending a lecture, role schemas, expectations of people's roles, like that of a teacher or parent, and self-schemas, one's perception of oneself, influencing behavior and self-esteem. These schemas are not rigid but adapt with new information, broadening or adjusting as we encounter new stimuli. In memory, schemas play a crucial role. They influence encoding, storage, and retrieval. When recalling an event, people often reconstruct memories, filling in gaps with schema-consistent details. This filling-in effect explains why memories are sometimes inaccurate. For example, individuals may misremember details of an event to fit their schemas, such as recalling a library setting as silent, even if it wasn't. Schema-driven memory errors highlight the reconstructive nature of memory, where the brain builds a coherent narrative rather than recalling precise details. Schemas also guide attention, focusing on schema-relevant information. This selective attention means that familiar schema elements are noticed while others may be ignored. This mechanism can lead to biases, as schemas make individuals less likely to notice information that conflicts with pre-existing beliefs. In learning, schema theory underscores the importance of prior knowledge. When teaching new concepts, educators often connect new information to students' existing schemas, facilitating comprehension and retention. For instance, in language acquisition, linking vocabulary to familiar concepts enhances learning speed and depth. By activating existing schemas, educators help students integrate new information meaningfully. Schemas also play a role in decision-making and social cognition. They affect how we interpret others' behavior, often through stereotypes, which are simplified schemas about groups. While schemas enable efficient thinking, they can also perpetuate stereotypes, leading to biased judgments. If you learn something new about how psychology affects our daily lives, then consider subscribing to my YouTube channel so that you don't miss the next episode. Until next time, stay sharp.